This is what you need to do before you come to Ghana. So let us help you make that arrangement. What's the time? 5.48. So it's 5.48 a.m. Early in the morning that we are leaving the airport. So guys, I just went to pick up one of our customers or a client who booked an Airbnb, a short stay with us. And we just went to pick him up. And it is 5.48 so you want to use the time so that you get to know the number of minutes it will take us to reach at the apartment. You understand? Uh, so in the advert, I advertise that it is 20 to 30 minutes. You understand? Uh -huh. So if it is 20 to 30 minutes, we are moving from the airport to Oyarefa. So we are going to check out and see how many minutes it's going to take us. Uh -huh. So we are currently in the car with um, the customer. So <laughs> there's no way we'll be lying to you. You understand? Yeah, so you can see we are actually at Akramo right now, and you can see how uh, the the day is breaking. You can see how Ghana looks like. So, so we left the airport around five yes, uh, four and five forty eight. So the time now, the time is five fifty two now. So that's three minutes from the airport to this place. So usually driving from the airport to Oyarefa, or you know coming from Accra to Medina. You know, there's no traffic early in the morning, though there's a little bit of traffic, as you can see. Yeah, but there's no much traffic. The only traffic you might face is moving from Medina or Yarafa, Adenta, those areas to Accra. Uh -huh. That is where you get some traffic. And that the traffic situation starts around 6.30, 6.30 going, you understand? Uh -huh. So around 5, there about, there's, there's less traffic for both sides. You understand? Oh, Ghanaians don't sleep. Ghanaians are hardworking people. <laughs> the Uber drivers from, you know, oh, everyone is awake that time. Yeah. So people think that oh, when you're Ghana, I'm on page. Sure. You've not been on the streets before. Sure. People are really hardworking. Eh? Some people are working like they are at Europe. Yes. They don't joke with their job. You see the time? It is 5.57 now. So that is nine minutes. We met, we left airport 5.48 and then we are here 5.57 as you can see. Uh, so that means it took us nine minutes to leave airport and we are currently at Atomic there, Atomic overhead there. So we'll definitely be in Medina in the period of 10 minutes. So that means that from the airport to Medina, Zongo Junction area, it took us 10 minutes. So what shows that we can use 10, 15 minutes to be at Oyarva? Uh -huh. So some of all, you know, want to confirm the actual time. So now it is 5.58 now. 5.58, as you can see. Uh -huh. So that means that it took us 10 minutes to be at Medina from the airport. Uh -huh. So you can see we are currently in Medina. And as you can see the overhead, that is the Medina Zungo Junction. Uh -huh. So next, I want to tell you that from the airport to Medina is 10 minutes. Don't argue with me. Eh? Don't argue with me. Some people love to argue, you see. Uh, so it depends on the time you move. If you leave early, you will not face traffic. But if you leave late, let's say around in the afternoon or let's say in the evening, around uh, 5 p.m. in the evening, definitely it wouldn't be 10 minutes. It would be more than that. Uh -huh. So the time or the time you move determines, you know, where you get to. You understand? So we have already left Medina. Uh -huh. We have left Medina. So this is um, Abokobi Junction. I will call and the time is what? 6, 7. So that is somewhere around uh, uh, 90 minutes. You understand? We left 5.48. So if you calculate up to 6, 7 a.m., that's 90 minutes. We are at Abokobi Junction. So we're going to see the number of minutes it take us to actually get to closer to the airport. Uh, the, you see, that where I'm showing you is actually the, you see the, the brown building. That is the apartment. So what is the time? What is the time? So opposite there is the uh, uh, Oyarefa Mall. So I said the apartment is opposite Oyarefa Mall. So you see the time we've just gotten there. Uh -huh. So you see this is the Oyarefa Mall. Under normal circumstance, we we're supposed to stop there. So if we were to stop there, oh, it would have been less than, you know, 25 minutes. But you know, you have to go and make a U-turn. You understand? So you have to pass the mall, go and read the tow boot, Oyarefa tow boot. Uh -huh. Then you make a U-turn to be able to get access to the apartment. So that takes us 
a little bit of a few minutes in addition you understand so we are making the u-turn at this place so you can see so at the normal circle if you had alighted at the uh oyan farm mall opposite or you are lighted at specialize there it would have been around 24 minutes to be at the airport eh, to be at the apartment but because we came forward and make a u-turn it takes us above you know um 25 minutes so in all definitely you see that the time will get to the apartment so that you get to know whether it has exceeded the time i have said in my adverts or in my ad or not so you see we have made the u-turn and we're actually going to the apartment you understand uh-huh so you see this is the mall this is the alpha mall see where we just where we passed already so we made a u-turn i hope you understand and you can see the brown building that is you know the apartment you understand uh-huh you see that is it right there so you see the time we are at it and it's 6 16 now 6 16. so if, if we left 5 48 a.m and we got there 6 16 you can know the number of minutes we use so that is around 28 minutes less than 30 minutes so in the video if i said it takes you 20 to 30 minutes to get to move from the airport to the apartment was i wrong i'm not wrong so it is between the time range which i said so that should tell you that it depends on the time you move and it's actually a very good location you can have access to the township you see where the uh, the apartment is you understand uh, so we are entering inside as you can see yeah see it's actually a store building you can see how the place is very neat very neat so you can see it's first floor second floor you understand uh-huh so we have the ground floor here and we are actually going inside yeah so you can see wow 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 you can see this is your washing machine uh -huh. and this is your um, safe you have your washing basin right here you have glass here then you go inside like this you have this you can see your toilet seat uh -huh. you also have um heater here uh-huh so you can see so forgive me so from there we actually move to the kitchen right here you have the kitchen you understand uh -huh. so you have the kitchen right here like this you can see how beautiful the kitchen is uh -huh. so everything in the kitchen is very new and it's beautiful you understand uh -huh. so you have your small dining table here you understand so you see in the kitchen you can see um uh, what do you guys call it a uh, microwave you have all those machines for cooking uh -huh. blender all those things the toaster you have your wash and basin you have all this stuff for your plates and everything uh -huh. so you have all this here here right yeah so you have your very big fridge here uh -huh. so it's a very neat place that you can see so forgive me i can give you 0 0.5 because i've changed a new phone and this is another like is a, a storeroom you understand so safe and beautiful you understand so forgive me i can give you 0 0.5 but you can see how beautiful the place is let's go from here we are going to the hall that's the main hall you can see the chairs the chairs are leather chairs they are smooth they are peaceful you can see that uh-huh so you can see all that so this is um, your television you have your beautiful fan you see how the fan is and you have your ac right there that's your air conditioner you have your a table lamp right here uh -huh. so it's actually a very nice location so you can see how the place is very peaceful and beautiful you understand uh -huh. so from the hall we are going to the first bedroom uh -huh. so this one this is the first bedroom you can see how the first bedroom is let me close this you can see how the first bedroom is you can see all that so beautiful wow they've changed the last time i came here there was no wardrobe like this but this time around there's a wardrobe so that's a wardrobe for you you have a very nice place to sit to make do your makeups and your dressing uh, you have your ac everything you need in the room is all here you understand you have here to hang your clothing uh-huh so let's go to the washroom you have your washroom here it's also clean you can see your toilet everything you see the lighting yes can see this is your wash and basin you can see your mirror uh-huh you can see all this right here so you can see so this is your heater uh-huh so everything that you need is actually inside there you understand so we move to the 
next one before we go into that place you have your iron table here there's an iron yeah he just moved it here so when you come everything is already done so we go to the second bedroom so with this apartment it's just a two-bedroom apartment however this second bedroom does not have a, a washroom inside it is the first washroom or the it shares the first uh, the first washroom that i showed you that's the visitor's washroom but the other one has a, a washroom inside it you understand so you can see these are the chairs that you have right here and you can see your dressing table and mirror you understand uh-huh you see how the place is so you can see you have a wardrobe here first time i came here there was no wardrobe now it has been improved you understand so you see your ac yeah so you have a very beautiful bed right here you can see that uh-huh so it's beautiful you have your hunger here everything that you need is in this room yeah everything is in the room yeah so that is just the first apartment that i've showed you i'll be going into the second apartment uh, which is empty now so that you get to actually uh, get a beautiful view of how the place is so it's interesting it's interesting you always stay tuned to watch the entire thing so that you yourself can have a beautiful view of how the place is so guys we don't need to talk much this is actually the end of the first apartment that i've just showed you and i'm very happy that you will like this place so it's very close to the township it's just at oyarafa uh -huh. oyarafa is around 30 minutes to 35 minutes drive to airport uh -huh. so this is what you need you don't need to go and book an apartment where it is very expensive this is so cheap i'll be putting the price at the end of the video so that you'll be able to add also um contact me and then book this hotel for yourself so thank you guys for your time i'm very grateful enjoy your day bye my name is my Imo name Risa is Imo Risa 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 subscribe subscribe thank you thank you